Hello everybody, welcome back to another video. My name is Nalo, and today we're going to be doing a challenge that my Discord actually suggested to me. Uh, this video idea was suggested by Koal the Alchemist, and I think it's going to be a pretty interesting one. So, uh, welcome to the pilot episode of Your Skins, My Trade-Ups. Name is still a work in progress, I don't really know what I'm going to call this thing. But as you can see here, uh, we have quite a lot of skins here, and none of them look all that great, to be completely honest with you. Uh, they, they don't look that awesome. Uh, what we have here is, uh, well, a bunch of trash skins, to be completely honest with you, but that's kind of the point of this video. Uh, I asked my Discord to suggest a bunch of 50 cent skins that they would like to see used in trade-ups, and uh, this is what we got. So, we got 10 of these uh, minimal wear, I believe they're all minimal wear, actually, yeah. 10 of these minimal wear Prisma Collection purples. Uh, which can trade up to the best uh, possible option, obviously, of a Aug Momentum Minimal Wear. But obviously we can get a Skull Crusher and Incinegator, which would kind of suck. Uh, we have an Aria Revolver Grip. The best possible option from this is a Moonrise. Again, it's Minimal Wear. We have some Desert Eagle Oxide Blazes. Uh, Ten of them, I had to buy them separately. <laughs> uh, they are field tested, meaning the best possible option is not really anything here. But I would like a, a little Crimson Tsunami and an XM Seasons. Those are both pretty nice. The Scaffold's kind of nice too. That'd be kind of cool to get. And then we have uh, the God Skin. The absolute God Skin. P250 Sand Dunes Battle Scarred. <laughs> the best possible option from this is uh, probably the AK Safari Mesh. Or the 5.7 Orange Peel. Uh, but the goal here is kind of just to try to make profit. Uh, it is possible to make profit on this. Especially if you get the Aug Momentum here. And, uh, yeah, we're going to start with the worst and go to the best. So, obviously, the best being the P250 Sand Dune. That'll be the last trade-up. So, we're going to go ahead and start with the R8 Grip. And, uh, yeah, if you want to participate in something like this, be sure to join my Discord. And I, I do have a lot of uh, people suggesting video ideas and stuff like that to me. So, if you want to participate in something like that in the future, just let me know by joining the Discord. And uh, you can participate in something once I announce it. Alright guys, let's do this first trade-up for the R8 Revolver Grip Minimal Wear. Uh, the best possible option, again, being the Glock Moonrise. Alright, we got a uh, Swag 7. I don't have that skin yet, never had it before. Um, kind of nice. What do we got for the floats? 1.11, that's not terrible. Alright guys, let's move on to the next trade-up here, the Desert Eagle Oxide Blaze. Desert Eagle Oxide Blaze, let's go boys. Let's try to get the best possible option of the Galil Crimson Tsunami or the XM Seasons with a blue leaf. A UMP Scaffold. Okay, I'm not even I'm not even upset about that. Field tested. Okay. Not too bad. I actually kind of like this skin. I like how it's mapped. Not terrible. Um, so we got a wear rating of 0.26 on this. Okay. Not, not that bad, actually. Alright, next let's do the Aug Momentum trade up here. And, uh, yeah, if you guys want to see more episodes like this, just let me know. That's kind of why I'm doing this pilot episode, to kind of gauge your interest in this kind of video and uh, see what you guys think about it. And, yeah, if you want to see a similar video like this, and if you want to see me do more episodes like this, then be sure to let me know in the comment section below, and then join the Discord so you can be part of it. All right, XM Incinegator. Of course it is. Build tested. All right. I don't know how much that's worth, but I'm going to go ahead and just go out on a limb and say it's probably not profit. Alright, finally the God Skin. This is for the AK Safari Mesh, but obviously each of these Sand Dunes is worth significantly more than the AK Safari Mesh. Just an absolute gigantic amount more than the Safari Mesh. And we got a Battle Scarred 57 Orange Peel. Alright. Would have been nice to get a Safari Mesh, I guess. If, if you can even call it nice. So we ended up with a Mag 7 Swag 7 and we'll wear a UMP Scaffold Field Tested, a XM Incinegator Field Tested, and a 5.7 Orange Field Battle Scarred. This ended up being field tested instead of minimal wear. That kind of sucks. That's about it for this episode, guys. If you enjoyed it, then be sure to leave me a like below. And consider subscribing to my channel. And also, if you want to be part of the series in the future, be sure to join my Discord server for when I do something like this again in the future. If it is, you know, highly requested. And, um, yeah. I'm going to go ahead and roll the outro, which is going to include if I made profit on this or not. So stick around for that. And uh, I'll see you guys next time. Peace. <laughs>